my channel. Um, happy day 33. I don't know why I say happy. Well, I mean, y'all, I want you to be happy. Um, it's day 33, I do believe. Um, yeah, so I thought I would just do a little vlog since I'm out and about going to a couple more Dollar Trees. Um, let me just say, me and my granddaughter, I'm going to try to beat this car out. Me and my granddaughter was supposed to have went to out to dinner as you guys know every now and then we do go out to dinner and wait a minute let me get out here i can't concentrate and talk at the same time is anybody else like that like no it's like whenever i go into a or i'm looking for something i have to turn the radio down and all that fun stuff so i'm gonna try to go right here right now i think i got it this is lid okay the ice okay now, yes, me and my granddaughter were supposed to go to dinner today, and she was wanting to go Chinese, and, um, like, I don't know, every two to three weeks, I do allow myself, you know, it still would be the one meal a day, okay, but I would eat whatever I wanted, you know, on that meal, whenever me and her go out to dinner, because that is something that I am just, I mean, it just, it, and honestly, it helps me to be able to go out to dinner every now and then and eat whatever I want. Like my last experience, if you watched, I was planning on being good and everything, but when I got there, my willpower was out the window. Um, and But that meal, that one meal that I had, it did not hurt me in, in any way whatsoever. Like I didn't gain weight that week. And I really enjoyed it, you know, the time with my granddaughter. We just had a great time. And, you know, I'm not going to stress over what I'm going to eat. Um, Chinese is my favorite food of all time. And, like, I'm going to eat, you know, that one meal. I'm not going to eat anything till we go. Um, but plans may have changed. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, we were supposed to go. And then now I think her mom's going to pick her up from school. So I don't know if that's still going to be on. If not today, then tomorrow, I guess. But, yeah, just want to say, you know, if you do, you know, plan, and, and like that book, I just wanted to say, like that book, um, Fast, wait, what is it, Eat, Fat, Fast, Repeat, whatever, something like that, Eat, Fast, Repeat, Eat, and something like that. Um, the lady that does that, she doesn't do one meal a day. Um, she does, like her eating window, I think, is maybe six hours or something, and she tells herself, you know, if she if, if she's planning on going to a birthday party or, you know, things come up in life that she will plan, you know, that in her eating window and she pretty much eats what she wants. You know, if she wants to have a piece of birthday cake, she does. Um, but just makes it in her eating window and then tries to, you know, stay away from that kind of stuff for the next few days. So you can plan your life around activities for your, fa you know, with your family and stuff like that and not sabotage yourself. Like, I'm going to have one meal a day today, just like I have been. I am going to be having more carbs. So basically, that's what it boils down to for me. So anyway, um, something else I was wanting to bring up. A lot of you guys had told me, you know, what vitamins y'all take in my last video. And a lot of you guys, this is a lot like mine. So... Like, I'm definitely going to start, you know, putting vitamins back in. I have not really got anything together yet. But that's basically, like, the ones that you are doing is kind of basically the ones that I'm doing. And it's kind of like the big, you know, the most important ones. I thought about, like, Googling the five most important vitamins to take. And I might do that. But anyway, another thing that I've been thinking a lot about is collagen because I've just been noticing like with this weight loss, um, my skin is like, you know, I'm 53. My skin is not bouncing back like it used to. I'm definitely getting some loose skin. I've been battling with this, um, I don't know what I call it. It's not really a double chin. It's more like the turkey neck trying to start and weight loss like really makes it more noticeable. So, uh, you know, I've been using Strivecta trying to, you know, keep up with that. But honestly, I still see that turkey neck. I hate that word. I hate using that word, but it is, that, that is what it is. Like, so, you know, I'm thinking about adding collagen 
And my thing is, like, that, like if you Google or, or go to Amazon and search, like, collagen, um, so many pop up, and you don't know, like, which ones are good and which ones are not, you know? So, what I'm going to do is, I've been seeing a commercial with Jennifer Aniston advertising collagen, and I'm like... If, if, that's the, if that wouldn't be a good collagen, then Jennifer Aniston would not be advertising it, you know? Somebody's not going to pay her a ton of money to advertise their product if it's crap, you know? And she probably wouldn't do it if it was crap. So, I'm going to Google whatever that collagen is that she's been advertising, and I'm going to get some. I don't know if I have to go to Walmart or if I have to order it online. I'm not sure. But I think taking collagen is really, really important. And I think I'm going to do like a series, not really a series, but a video on the benefits of collagen. Um, I'm going to have to like look them up tonight, write them down. So maybe tomorrow I can do the benefits of collagen and, you know, and weight loss and just anti-aging and, you know, stuff like that. Because I think it's really an important thing. And honestly, I used to drink collagen and whatever kind I had, you could mix it in like black coffee and you couldn't even taste it. Like, it totally has no taste whatsoever. So, I'm totally um, going to be doing that. I did have my black coffee this morning. Of course, no collagen. Um, but now, I'm working on my water. I've got this water here that is very icy. It's been in my car for a couple of days. So, I'm going to be working on this while I'm out and about today. So, I just left one Dollar Tree going to a second one. And... I was going somewhere else and I forgot. I don't know. I might look up that collagen and see who has it and maybe run by and see if I can find it. But anyway, let me know if you're interested in me doing a collagen excerpt or, or whatever episode. A collagen episode. Let me know. Um, okay, I'll be back later to show you guys um, when I get on the exercise bike, which I'm going to, and then when I eat dinner. Oh no, I gotta get through this little area here. They're working on the road and it's like going through some kind of a, I don't know what, maze. It's like a maze. There's like, it's crazy. Okay. All right guys, so I'll be back to show you, you know, what I just said, my food and stuff. Okay, bye. Hey guys, so I am here and I have Jack with me. And it's really funny because I just now said all of this and she said, you know, you're not actually filming. And I thought I was. So, yeah, I'm glad I have her with me. Um, it worked out. We're here at the Channel One Buffet. We're getting ready to go in. It's closed. No, it's open. It's open. Oh. We're getting ready to go in and we are going to pig out. Totally. Um, if I can, I'll do a little video in there just to show you what I have on my plate. I'm excited. So anyway, guys, just wanted to let you know it did work out. We are at the China place, Chinese food for dinner. My one meal a day, I haven't had anything. Set black coffee and water. It is 512 and this will be, you know, after I eat, that'll be it. But anyway, we are going to go pick out, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, guys, see you in there, hopefully. Okay, guys, so it's the end of day 33 and um, me and my granddaughter did go in to have the Chinese. Um, I thought better, uh, I thought better when I, because I did record what I had in there and, you know, showed the plate and stuff like that, but I didn't want that to be like a trigger to someone who, you know, has a weakness for Chinese and, you know, who may be right on the edge and stuff. So I did, I'm not going to show the food just because like, I'm like that. I'm like, I, like I've said a ton of times, I'm visual seeing that stuff. Um, you know, may, if I'm teetering on the edge, it might make me fall off the edge. So basically, you know, I had that meal that was my one meal of the day and I enjoyed it fully and I don't feel guilty about it. And I feel so good about my new relationship with food. Can I just say that at one time, like, if I would have went out to Chinese, a Chinese dinner in the middle of, uh, you know, a, a weight loss journey, that would have been it. I would have given up and I would have been like, oh, I really 
screwed up now, you know, and you know, the next day, that evening, you know, that would have just threw me completely off of the wagon. So I just want to say that I feel like my relationship with food is so much better right now. I just can't even say just because, um, I don't know. I just, I just feel, I just feel different. I just feel different about it. Um, and I also want to say if you are doing one meal a day and you have something like I had today that is higher in calories, higher in carbs, you know, um, just more than I normally would eat. Um, that doesn't mean that you're off your program. That just means that you had a different type of meal for your one meal a day. And that means that, you know, the next several meals or the next couple weeks or whatever, you know, just take it, take it easy and eat the way I have been eating, you know, with the fruit and, and all that stuff. That doesn't mean I screwed up. It doesn't mean that at all. That means my meal today was different than it normally is. I enjoyed it. Um, it wasn't as good as I thought it would be. So that's kind of strange. Like usually when I think of Chinese, you know, and I had been anticipating it all day long, I always think, you know, it's the best. I'm going to eat as much as I possibly can because, you know, I've always had such a bad relationship with food, but there has been a slight change in me and my relationship with food. And I am absolutely thrilled to have said that it's taken this long. I can't say 53 years because I haven't, haven't really had issues with food. I mean, I know for a fact, like maybe since I've, since I was at least 10 years old, I've had a relationship with food that was very unhealthy. So I feel like now there has been a shift. There's been a shift guys and I am embracing it and I'm thoroughly excited about it and what it holds for my future. Um, this way of eating is number one to me. It's, it's totally enjoyable. It's doable. I never feel weak or trembly or, you know, anything like that. It's just like a number one to me, one meal a day, baby, one meal a day. This is going to get the job done finally. And anyway, I just wanted to say that to you guys. If you have I'm not even going to call it a cheat meal. If you decide to have something, um, a, a whole cake, I don't know, like, you know, a humongous bowl of cereal for dinner instead of, you know, a regular, regular dinner, you know, that's your meal. That's your meal. As long as you don't do that every day, you're going to still continue to lose weight. And I would just bet that when I weigh myself on my next weigh in, that I am still going to have a loss, even though I had this different meal. So I just want to put that out there just, you know, in case that you are struggling or are really craving something. And if you're trying to do this, um, don't think that your one meal has to be all, you know, all pretty and perfect because sometimes it's not sometimes it's not pretty and perfect and that's okay so anyway i just wanted to end this day you know just telling that, that to you guys i did not get on my exercise bike or do any exercise today so hopefully i can make up for that tomorrow um anyway i just i have been drinking tons of water because chinese totally makes me super thirsty but anyway i just wanted to let you guys know that and you know Pay that good news forward to you guys. Okay, thank you for joining me for day 33. Um, I hope I'm right in saying day 33. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Um, hopefully, yeah, 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 yeah. Let me know. Don't forget to let me know if you're interested in the benefits of collagen, okay? Because I'm going to be working on that tonight. It's 1122 right now. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be working on that tonight. But let me know if you're interested in an episode of the benefits of collagen. And I actually ordered me some collagen. So I'm going to show you guys like what I ordered and, and you know, all that. So anyway, thanks for watching. Have a great night, everyone. Bye.